I have a very interesting question that comes from an individual named Sash in Sydney, Australia. Can one get a demon from watching too many of your exorcisms? I've actually heard people say, I don't want to come to a Bob Larson seminar where live exorcisms take place. One of those demons may jump out on me. And I answer them, you aren't going to get a demon that you don't want. Demons only go where they're invited. Interestingly enough, Christ didn't seem to show any concern that the demons he cast out were going to afflict the people who are watching. Quite the contrary. What he did was a testament to his divinity. And what I do in the name of Jesus is proof of the power of Jesus Christ and the authority that he has given us. You get demons from open doors of sin and also generational curses. So maybe the question we should be asking is, can you get demons from generational curses? The answer is yes. So we should be confessing our sins and breaking these curses and walking in obedience to Jesus Christ. You could get a demon from an unhealthy fascination. Let's say that you watch an exorcism and you want the power of the possession, or you want to know what it feels like to have a demon, you ask a demon to come into you. But just by watching? No, you're not going to get a demon. Unless you've got some kind of a twisted pathological mind. Matthew 5.29 speaks of if your eye offends you, pluck it out. Well, people take that allegorical illustration of Christ and have actually done it literally and physically damaged themselves and even gone blind because they really didn't understand what Scripture was saying. To the person who has asked this question, Sash, keep watching, keep seeing the power of God in action. The great commission of Jesus Christ in Mark 16, 15, we are to go into all the world Preach the gospel to every creature. And the first sign of the authenticity and the integrity of the gospel is the casting out of demons. Let's get the focus where it belongs. On doing what Jesus did. Not looking at what some twisted mind might do if they read any part of the Bible. But to understand that our responsibility as believers is to wage spiritual warfare against the powers of darkness, to take unto ourselves the armor of God, and in the name of Jesus, set the captives free. And the reason I allow people to see that on YouTube is so that they can know the power of Christ is available for them to be free from the powers of darkness. Cancel curses, break soul ties, cleanse your ancestry, and cast out demons. Enroll now in the International School of Exorcism and the Advanced Academy of Deliverance. In our new book, Set Your Family Free, we teach how to raise children with purity principles, how to prepare them for adulthood, and how to break every assignment of Satan over their lives. We give you the principles of spiritual warfare to fight for your family and to be victorious over the powers of darkness. This is the book that will set your family free. How do you know if your problems are the result of bad life choices or demons? My 200 page book, Dealing with Demons, has answers for questions most are afraid to ask. Can Christians be demon possessed? How can I know what's natural and what's supernatural? Dealing with demons will teach you how to recognize symptoms that the devil is at work in your life. Be one step closer to living in spiritual victory. The most frequent demon that I deal with is the spirit of Jezebel. This demon wants to destroy your health, your finances, your marriage, your family, and your church. My book, Jezebel, is your key to overcoming the most prevalent evil spirit of our age. Get your copy today. He took the curses away from me. Go see Bob Larson because he can help you.
If your life isn't all that it should be, if relationships aren't working, if your health, your finances, or your spiritual life are unhappy, schedule a personal one-on-one encounter with me. We'll get to the root of the issues that are holding you back. We'll give you answers in a whole new direction in life. Oh, what a change, what a difference when you have an encounter with God. Take action. I look forward to seeing you soon. For the latest information on resources, seminars, conferences, training institutes, retreats, and international missions, go to boblarson.org. Thank you for your prayers and financial partnership.